Most people think hacking takes years of coding, sleepless nights, and reading boring textbooks. That's the expectation. But what if I told you that learning how to hack, ethically, professionally, and even profitably, is faster than you think? That today, with the right tools and mindset, you can go from complete beginner to pro-level hacker in months, not years. And you don't even need a degree. That's the reality. Because in 2025, hacking isn't just about technical skill. It's about understanding how systems and people work. Yes, this video will show you exactly how to hack the quick way. Not only that, but I'm handing you the blueprint I used to go from clueless noob to successful ethical hacker with real-world projects under my belt. And yes, the ability to hack into phones, passwords, and even corporate networks. Legally, of course. But here's the twist. The tools and techniques aren't even the hard part. This video is for ethical hacking and educational purposes only. We do not promote illegal activity. Black hat hacking can get you arrested, sued, or worse. What you're about to learn is meant to empower security professionals and anyone who cares about their digital safety. What separates wannabe hackers from paid professionals is something far more overlooked. And you'll discover that in just a moment. So watch closely. Don't skip. 1. Learn the tools of the trade. Let's start with what everyone wants to know. The tools. Because you can't build a career in hacking without mastering the digital weapons of the trade. You'll hear names like Nmap, Metasploit, Wireshark, Burp Suite, and SQLMap thrown around like candy. But here's the truth. Most beginners just download them and get overwhelmed. So here's how to make them work for you. Start with offensive tools like Metasploit for payloads, Nmap for scanning, and Burp Suite for intercepting web traffic. Then move into defensive tools like Snort, or Suricata for intrusion detection, and basic firewall configs. Get comfortable using GitHub to find scripts, exploits, and automation tools. Hey, sorry for interrupting your video, but I wanted to know, are you interested in building a career in ethical hacking? We created Learn Ethical Hacking from Scratch course just for you, and it's the perfect way to get started. In this course, you will learn how ethical hackers find vulnerabilities in your system, networks, and applications. You will learn hands-on skills like penetration testing, exploiting the weakness in a system, and all the tools that hackers use. You will also learn how to stay on the right side of the law. Cybersecurity is one of the fastest growing industries in the world and hackers are high in demand. The global cybersecurity market is expected to reach $400 billion by 2028. There's never been a better time for you to jump in. Ethical hackers earn from $90,000 US dollars to $120,000 US dollars annually. Experts in this field make even more. So are you ready to kickstart your journey into ethical hacking? This course is your key to mastering hacking. We have placed the link to this course in the description. Enroll today and get started on a lucrative career path. Now back to the video. Create a playground on your own machine with Kali Linux or Parrot OS. These come preloaded with hundreds of tools to test legally in a controlled environment. Why it matters. Knowing the tools is like learning to use a scalpel before performing surgery. Most people skip straight to hacking, but the real pros sharpen their tools first. But knowing tools alone won't make you dangerous. What will? Your strategy. And here's where it gets crazy. 2. Train like a pro. The single most important skill? Practice. You can memorize every port, every command, and every tool. But if you don't train in realistic environments, it's useless. That's where platforms like Try Hack Me, Hack the Box, and Capture the Flag challenges come in. They simulate real-world hacking scenarios where you can legally practice and fail without consequences. Your job? Treat hacking like a sport. Schedule one to two hours daily to solve challenges, 
exploit vulnerabilities, reverse engineer binaries, or dissect packet captures. Make it a game. Even if a challenge takes six hours, good. That's where real growth happens. You'll build muscle memory that no YouTube tutorial can give you. Why this works? The number one trait of top hackers isn't talent. It's brutal consistency. They show up daily, fail forward, and log their progress. But if you're thinking, what should I even start with? That's what we'll hit next. Three, start with systems, not code. You don't need to learn programming first. Start with networks. Understand how the internet actually works. Learn the OSI model. Learn what DNS, HTTP ports, and protocols do behind the scenes. Then, become fluent in command line interfaces on both Windows and Linux. Trust me, GUIs are for casuals. Real hackers live in the terminal. After that, move into enumeration, learning how to scan, probe, and identify vulnerable systems. Then you'll know where to exploit, not just how. Now, if you do want to learn coding later, and you should, start with Python. It's simple, powerful, and widely used in automation and exploit writing. Why it matters. Hackers don't just break things. They understand how systems are built, so they know where to apply pressure. But there's one more layer you must master, and it has nothing to do with computers. Four, master people, not just machines. The most dangerous hackers don't need to write zero days. They make you give them the password. That's called social engineering, the psychological side of hacking. It's the art of manipulating people to hand over sensitive data, install malware, or click phishing links. Here's the shocking part. According to Verizon's data breach report, 82% of breaches involve the human element. Start small. Create simulated phishing emails using tools like GoFish. Study human behavior. Read Social Engineering, The Art of Human Hacking by Chris Hadnagy. Test your skills ethically by running awareness campaigns in your team, family, or organization with permission. Why it works. Machines follow logic, humans don't. And that makes them the easiest entry point for a skilled hacker. But now, let's talk about the elephant in the room. Legal risk. Ethics, legality, and real career paths. Here's what they don't tell you in the cool hacking montages. If you don't follow ethical guidelines, you will end up in legal trouble. Always hack with permission. Always use signed contracts before penetration testing. Familiarize yourself with laws like the Computer Fraud and Abuse Act in the US or your country's equivalent. Now for the good news, ethical hackers are in high demand. You can specialize in red teaming, blue teaming, digital forensics, or even bug bounty hunting on platforms like HackerOne and BugCrowd and earn money doing it. Certifications like OSCP, CEH, and CBBH can boost your credibility, but what matters most is a strong portfolio. Build one by documenting every challenge you solve, tool you create, or exploit you discover. So let's bring it full circle. You came here wondering how to hack, the quick way. And now you know, hacking isn't about shortcuts. It's about the right sequence. First, you master the tools. Then, you train consistently. Next, you understand systems. Then, you understand people. And finally, you stay ethical, build a portfolio, and join the community. This is the blueprint. This is the fast lane. Not because it skips the hard work, but because it skips the wasted work. That's it for now. If you liked the video, feel free to like, subscribe, and don't forget to press the bell icon so you don't miss the next one. And if you have a comment, whether it's a question or just something you're curious about, drop it below. And remember, don't just learn to hack, learn to think like a hacker.